guy just on the beat. and welcome back to my channel and if you're new hi i'm sin and welcome to my channel and by the title of this video you already know what we're about to get into your girl made an only fans for a week and this is how much i made and this is how it went so before we actually get into the video a little shameless promo if you guys are interested in subscribing to my only fans make sure you click the link down in the description box i do have a special going on i'm gonna do 20 percent off for the first 10 subscribers and then for the next 15 subscribers i'm gonna do 15% off so make sure you click the link and subscribe if you're thinking about creating a OnlyFans link I mean OnlyFans account and my video helped you out make sure you click down below and sign up through my referral link so shameless promo let's go ahead and get into the video so to start off if you guys do not know what you should know because OnlyFans have been out majority of the quarantine it's just a subscriber based website where your fans subscribe to get exclusive content that you post they subscribe for a monthly fee that you set i think the lowest you can set it at is three dollars and the max is beyond your dream and um people just subscribe they can pay monthly and see whatever you post and you can also do private stuff in the dm and they pay to see that type of stuff as well that's kind of like the basis of only fans so to do, give a little uh, background about me number one i am 21 i am very legal number two i am single I would have, I probably wouldn't have more than likely did this if I was still with my ex-boyfriend. But I, being with him, I did respect the fact that he wouldn't have liked me to do the stuff. Now, I do like to test the waters. I do like to test the boundaries. So, a lot of times I would kind of like pick saying that I would do stuff like this. But I really probably wouldn't have done it with him being my boyfriend. But like I said, I'm single. So, it is what it is at this point. Three, my mom and stuff is she knows about it again i'm 21 but she's okay with it my sister's okay with it like the family members that i have told already they're all fine with it it's a very safe way for me to do what i want to do and to get paid for it so that's fine just in case anybody's trying to troll what i'm doing in the comments just let you know it doesn't matter unless you want to message me to let me know that you want to pay the bills and i'm paying with the money that i'm making but anyway so back on it so i had started on um, my only fans i actually got approved and started actually doing it on the 31st so the process of doing it was i signed up through twitter i highly recommend when you start the sign up process if you have a twitter click sign up through twitter it's so much easier do that and once you set up the account you have to verify yourself you have to send in a picture of your id a picture of um your id and a picture of you with your id just to know it's no fraud, no mess going on. You have to do that. And then it takes about one to two days for them to verify it. It takes one to two days for them to verify it. And with me, the first day actually didn't go through. Like, it was like my ID. It didn't look right. So, I had to redo my ID picture with better lighting and have it where you can actually see the ID and see me at the same time very clear. And so, then the next day after that, I was approved and I started to promote and make um and post my content so um, i actually wrote down like each day and it was very nerve-wracking i was very scared to stop promoting for it because at first i was very worried about what people was going to say i was very worried about like i I was freshly like not freshly broken up my boyfriend's probably like a few with well, my ex-boyfriend it was probably like a few days but i was very concerned about what he was going to say what other people was going to say how people was going to look at me but i was just like you know what the circumstances that i am in as in like my part-time job might as well call it my teaspoon quarter quarter job like i don't make nothing from there they barely work me as it is so i had that and i do have my business that i work from but i don't like to eat too much out of my business because i have a vision for it so i wanted to grow so i didn't want to be taking so much money from my business so i was like well this is a very easy at home simple way you know if he want to pay my bill then i'm gonna take it word for Maggie, you know what i'm saying so i was just like okay i'm gonna go ahead and see what it is so i would just like bump it if anybody got something to say, I'm just letting know. If you can't give me the money I'm making from here, then please leave me alone. So, I just went ahead and I kind of posted it. I had it on my Snapchat. I posted it on my, I think, my Instagram. And that was it. I would not post it on my Facebook because I have family on Facebook. I didn't want them seeing that. So, I just posted it on my Snap and on my Instagram. And so, from that, on the first day, I had got 
two subscribers well two two fans two subscribers whatever and now i was so happy i had got two fans but i didn't get them until like the end of the day like late the end of the day because i was getting scared like oh my gosh i done did all of this people are already looking at me like i'm crazy and i only i ain't getting no fans but i had got two because i had got a few people that sort of like no oh, talisa don't do that don't do that what are you doing blah, 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 blah. But again, it was people who probably, they never gave me a dollar in their life. So, again, it doesn't matter. But, so then when the second day came, I had got another fan. But again, I wasn't really promoting. And when it did come to promoting, I had um got paid promotion. So, I basically paid people to promote me on their page because I didn't want to promote too much on mine. Because I really wasn't at the place wanting to let people know what I was doing yet. So, I had paid um some pages that was just like... Maybe kind of like focused around like, you know, lingerie or posted around stuff like that. I paid them to promote. It was very cheap promo. So the two days I did that, I had got two more fans, one each day. And so then the fourth day was when it was like stuff started speeding up. So the fourth day I got four fans. But again, I was promoting more and doing more stuff. And I believe either the fourth or the fifth day, I created my side Snapchat, which was at Sin City Triple X, which is my only fans name. So I had um, made a snap for that and that's when it's kind of like it started speeding up because I was promoting on that snap. I was um, using my Snapchat to tag it to be like add me over there. And then the fifth day I got four more fans. So I just kept, you know, building on the, the momentum. The sixth day I had actually got six fans in total. Like that whole day I had went through that whole day and got six whole fans. Which is crazy to me because literally first day I only got two. The next two days I got one a day. And I got six whole fans like one day and then on the seventh day i had got four more fans so if you count today in total but um today in total i have 29 fans which today is the eight i have 29 total fans and honestly to tell you guys the truth you don't need a lot of fans to be making money my advice is take a little bit of fans that you have and like talk with them you know you kind of have to you have to work them basically like make them feel good make them feel like you really like you you want to give them attention some you might actually like talking to like i have a few that i would not mind actually holding a conversation with and then i have a few that's just like i'm only really holding this conversation because i'm about to I'm about to send you something with a fee on it like you know you just have to your social skills have to be up to par to make more you know to make more money or whatever so you don't need a lot of fans that just kind of helps to add you know to add a little something because your subscription fee most of the time like mine regularly is $18 that's how much my only fans cost regularly i have a lot of sales sometimes and then sometimes i don't have sales but my regular price is 18 dollars. 18 times 20 don't know what it is but just saying that's not you know that's a lot of money but it's not a lot of money in only fans world so you have to really work in the messages to like you know get your money up but anyway yeah so to really get your money up so with me what i do is my regular feed is just lingerie me dancing around like stuff that you know that's cute sexy that if somebody was to feel the need i don't know why but if they was to feel the need to like screenshot it and post it somewhere i would not actually have a like it wouldn't be a huge problem because it's something that i probably would have posted before like it really wouldn't be a huge problem but also that remind me to also say do realize that with this it is a um like it's going on your taxes <laughs> like you have to fill out a w9 it's going on your taxes so the money you're making make sure that you're realizing how much you're making make sure that you're saving something when taxes come around since this is self-employment you are gonna have to pay taxes on it this money is gonna be taxed so save your money and also like i said it's gonna be on your taxes so people will be able to see for a little while that you was doing you know, OnlyFans, they don't know what you was doing on OnlyFans, but you had an OnlyFans account and you was making money from it. So just be aware of that. I want people to know that. I'm trying to think of anything else that I would like to add up here. Oh yeah, so when it comes to getting paid, don't think this is something that is quick. This is not a get rich quick scheme. And I mean that in a sense of when you get your money, it's not going to you like at that very moment. Literally, if someone pays you $25 today on the first, that money is not going to move. It's gonna be in your pending. Your um, it's gonna be in your pending balance, right? So it's in your pending balance seven days passed on the eight the exact time that they sent it to you so on the if they sent it to you on the first at three o'clock three o'clock on the seventh is when it's going to move to your current balance 
and you have to have a minimum of $20 in your current balance for you to be able to transfer it to your actual bank account which is going to take another three to five days depending on who you bank with and when you send it over so it's not like oh I get paid Monday and I'm gonna get this money out of my OnlyFans account on Tuesday it's nothing like that that money does not actually move until seven days why I don't know I don't get that I honestly thought that it was you got to have your account for seven days before you can like send all your money so if you made three hundred dollars after seven days you can trans like that three hundred dollars in there you can take it no but i know you guys are probably like okay let's just go ahead and get straight to what you made in your week like what what you had going on so before i get to that i would just like to say number one um what is it number one only fans does take 20 percent of your money 20 percent goes to only fans you keep 80 i feel like that's a pretty good deal i don't honestly mind that because 20 percent is compared to like what you could be making if someone pays you a hundred dollars they keep 20 that's not that bad compared to what it could be so you know that's cool and also it's just a website if you look up only fans in that um app store and it's like 399 that is not only fans that is something else it is not the same thing so let's just go ahead and get into this so my all time which technically is not seven days is one day over seven but still because i was gonna make this video yesterday didn't ever get to record a video but from july 31st until today which is august 8th in total what i've made which compared to all the videos that i watched in their one week your girl was working i had a goal and i hit my goal so this is how much i made in a week on uh, of only fans if you can see it if not of course i'm have a screenshot on the screen as well so in a week my gross total off of just only fans was one thousand two hundred and twelve dollars and ten cents that is my growth my net what i actually get to keep and take with me is nine hundred and sixty nine dollars and sixty six cents but in total oh yeah i'm gonna have to put this in there somewhere near my cash app i mean my snapchat if i didn't say it. do not put your only fans link on snapchat they will close down your snapchat account they will lock it my um other snapchat is currently locked right now <laughs> this is what it says when i try to log into my cat my snapchat they permanently locked it like I can't get back into it because they picked up on the link that I was posting and so yeah do not post your OnlyFans link on your snapchat do not do it so in total total including like this the money that I had got off of cash out because of the bank stuff has stopped working I made a total of one thousand two hundred and fifty seven dollars and twenty six cents which my goal for the week was to make a thousand dollars and I went over and beyond that so that is just to let you guys know like it is possible like literally my i got paid yesterday from my part-time job and my check was less than 200 dollars for two weeks and i made in one week over one thousand dollars i choose the only fans for 200 alex <laughs> like come on now like really like I, it, it, it's, it fathoms me I never had a job where I made that much money even in two weeks in a month so that's crazy to me um and I tell people like I don't I didn't create an OnlyFans just to make more money I made OnlyFans because I have two goals that I kind of want to meet financially and one goal is kind of like up here one is like down here and when I say that I mean the amount of money so it's like by the time I make it to this goal it'll give me time to think is it really worth spending that much money on and if my mind is like no then I'm gonna put my money into this goal and if my mind is like yeah girl we still gonna go for it I'm just gonna go ahead and get that goal but yeah I'm definitely going to continue doing OnlyFans do I recommend people to do OnlyFans? I only recommend it if you do your research and if you're willing to do it. Like, if you really want to do it, I do recommend giving it a try. If you are not comfortable doing it, I do not recommend it. And if you feel like, if you're a bit, like, too worried about what people are going to say to the point where you don't want to do it, I do not recommend you doing it. Because people are going to say stuff, people are going to talk. But honestly, I've had more positive um, feedback than negative, to be honest. Like, ever since I started my OnlyFans, I've had a lot of females that hit me up like oh my gosh how did you get the courage to start oh my gosh i want to start one 
like i've wanted to fight one for a while but i just you know it's just it's crazy to think like especially in my like small town that other people actually wanted to do this so you know you never know like i said i only recommend it if you really want to do it and if you don't mind those one or two people who are going to give you negative feedback compared to the people who are going to be like yes sis get your coins like you know make their pockets hurt if they want to give you the money take it like it is what it is so that is my week only fan experience um if you guys would like me to come back with a month update let me know if you would like me to make you know like a tips and tricks video i've been watching other people's videos and it kind of like motivated me to want to make you know my video so if you guys are interested in more only fans content on youtube let me know again my link is down below make sure you catch the sale before the 25 for your first 25 people do so yeah so hopefully i will see you guys in my next one this is sin signing off Thanks, it's on the